Hello there, great people. I hope you are doing well. Greetings from Portugal. My name is Nuno. Thank you for stopping by for a new video. And today's topic is macOS Mojave Beta 4. I will divide this video in three topics. First, all the Geekbench build number. Uh, afterwards, we are talking about the new things. And uh, on the final, we are going to talk on the things that are broken. And I will leave this to the final. Uh, part of the video because there are some things that you you can rely and uh, uh, honestly this beta broke a lot of things so without further ado let's start first with the build number of this uh, release so a screenshot here because I have to erase my serial number for privacy reasons so the build number for this beta is the 18A 336E Okay, build number and we are running of course as you can see just for you to check a 15 inch mid 2015 2.5 gigahertz intel core i7 16 gigs of ram and uh, dual graphic cards okay the amd radeon r9 m 370x with two gigabytes and also the intel iris pro with uh, one and a half uh, gigabytes okay now let's go to uh, how many gigs it was it were required to install this about 2.90 gigs it was a fast installation no problems whatsoever there okay now let's go to one of the things that everyone likes to see geekbench so in this system that i told you uh, all the specs uh, it's very similar to the previous build so the beta 3 we are running the almost the same multi-core score and the single core score no uh, main differences there and uh, regarding you know the speed tests uh, disk speed test um, the same also everything is green so uh, the results are very very similar with the previous builds okay so no issues there also stacks working without any flaws pretty fluid you know quick look also with the ability you know to make your the the edits perfect no issues there now let's go to the good stuff now uh, what's good what's good no what's new <laughs> first uh, uh, it takes a long long time to click now the desktop and screensaver and I will tell you why probably there is a new uh, dynamic wallpaper this one uh, it is also uh, dynamic it is you know uh, solar gradient that's the name of the of it uh, and as you can see there is a glitch there I don't know what is going on you know here it's uh, a little bit yeah orange and blue and you know we are now at uh, 12 o'clock uh, a.m. okay and almost 12 o'clock and it's dark blue so probably uh, it's not working because I'm seeing here a shift between you know a light blue and a dark blue and I'm seeing my wallpaper is for me it seems dark so uh, not working but it is dynamic so expect that on this new beta release but you know <laughs> it's it's a plain uh, uh, you know uh, a normal uh, wallpaper well I'm digressing let's go to the to the normal one now you have uh, I, did, I didn't knew that but uh, on the dark mode now when you click on the dark mode uh, you only have of course you have if you are at, on the time of the day and running the dynamic wallpaper and since it is morning here in Portugal you uh, still have the morning wallpaper or the light wallpaper but you have the dark mode enabled on all the applications you know that support it of course so uh, everything seems you know better now if you want to deal with dark mode you can deal with it and still have the dynamic wallpaper walk, walk, uh, working properly now guys this is in fact all the things that are new so nothing new that I've discovered so expect this on the on this new build now let's go on what I want to focus is what is broken okay let's start with Safari and see new glitch quit open again okay let's start with safari 
Guys, if you rely on Safari and if you rely on private browsing, uh, if you want to open a new private window, you cannot do it. Okay, so private browsing on Safari not working. Not a big issue to me for me because I don't use private browsing. Uh, so, but not working whatsoever. Even here on the dock, if you want to open a new private window, no, not working. Okay, so let's close it again. Let's do it. New private window not working okay if you can go if go a new window also not not open and as if as you can see i quit it's open but if you click it nothing happens quit and open again so big there are you know since this is beta 4 i didn't expect you know this uh, to happen but you no know, there's a glitch there and of course it's a better not to blame apple whatsoever now guys if you rely on facetime uh, that is a major issue if you rely on facetime and if you rely on video calls uh, they are not working so for me they are not working if they are working for you go ahead put in the comments if you don't have this issue because uh, i have three cameras here guys so if i go i want to go to the video tab uh, i have three cameras so i have the a logitech camera i have my uh, uh, camera web camera from my uh, cinema display and also i have the the eyesight camera from from the macbook but none of them are present here only sound microphone i can use the uh, the web from my webcam the logitech but there isn't a, an option enabled for webcam so if you want to make facetime calls with video uh no it's a no it's not working for me so i don't know if it's only my problem uh, or if it is a general uh, problem so not working and if also if you want to make some call, uh, calls uh, facetime calls only um, sometimes they work sometimes they don't okay sometimes uh, you see your iphone uh, bright up uh, telling you that he's making the call and sometimes it doesn't so if you rely on this on an everyday basis guys that's a reason not to upgrade okay so these are the major issues that i find i found till now um, there are of course some glitches here and there for example some things here for example if you click on privacy as you can see this huge icon in the automation <laughs> it's a glitch but this these are small things uh, the big things is that if you rely on private browsing uh, forget that doesn't work on safari and if you trust and use uh, facetime calls video or audio audio works sometimes video doesn't work okay now uh, the video works in skype uh, but you know it's a little bit laggy and even the sound it's laggy also so if you use skype be careful but uh, guys this is what uh, i've discovered uh, i haven't found anything you know uh, new at this point but this video is a follow-up is a follow it's a, a first look um, and if i discover of course new things i will post a new video by the way guys today is tuesday the 17th and uh, i'm supposing apple will launch the ios uh, 12 beta 4 so i will release a video uh, on what the new things and if i found if I find anything broken broken uh, like I'm, I'm doing on this video i will launch it okay so expect a video for me today from me today uh, if uh, apple release the new ios 12 beta 4 now guys there are my social links over there if you want go ahead uh, subscribe and follow me because I post on Twitter when I'm launching a new videos and also on Instagram and if you want to subscribe guys and if you like this kind of content go ahead um, uh, and click that subscribe button I don't like to ask but guys if you want go ahead do it it's your option so thank you for stopping by once again and I hope to see you very very soon bye bye